News from Washington, D.C. Our Adriano Cotero speaks with Congressman Greg Khalili Sablan to hear from the Capitol the major issue at hand. That is the delay in the U.S. CIS guidelines for the NMI U.S. Workforce Act. In July 2018, President Donald Trump signed the Northern Mariana Islands U.S. Workforce Act into law. And 180 days later, or by January 20th, 2019, a new set of guidelines were to be released by the United States Citizenship and Immigration Services. Now, two weeks later, and no regulations are in place. Currently, in a delay. From Washington, D.C., Congressman Greg Khalili Sablan speaks with KSPN2. We have also been trying to get USCIS to, one, give us a briefing on what we should expect from the regulations. Uh, they can't do that until the, they issue the regulations, both uh, from the Department of Labor and from the Department of Homeland Security. When asked if this delay is a result from the government shutdown, Congressman says, regardless, they are just late. There's no penalty for issuing the regulations late, so it is a problem. I'm still asking for a briefing, and yet I have been told by both the Department of Labor and the Department of Homeland Security that the first briefing they can give me is when they make public the regulations. So I, um, uh, this has not been how it's done in the past, but I guess a new administration, this is how it's done this, this, this way. The guidelines are to govern the process and implementation of this law that extends the CW permit program by 10 years with the transition period to end in December 2029 and a cap set to 13,000 CW visa permits for fiscal year 2019 with annual decreases set. Congressman Khalili Sablan asked USCIS to at least publish guidance for people and in response USCIS tells him that applicants should follow Follow the existing procedure. Oh, it's just some messes up the processing for paperwork for individuals, for for employers, and obviously their employees. Uh, probably some of the employees may have uh, permits that expire. Uh, employers are going to need to start planning on when to start submitting uh, paperwork. They should have a uh, hundred and and 80 days to submit the paperwork for their renewals or new hirings. Uh, but we don't know that until we see the new regulations. Khalili says delayed regulations on my Northern Mariana Islands U.S. Workforce Act is just one way that the Trump administration's immigration policy is hurting the Marianas. Reporting for KSPN2 News, I'm Adriana Cotero.